brace yourself everyone Mark Andre Fleury has been traded from the Vegas Golden Knights and this is what you could say is a little unexpected maybe it was expected some people say they expected it but here we are he will not be finishing out his career with the Vegas Golden Knights he will be sent to the Chicago Blackhawks and we're going to be talking about that so basically here's what happened uh, they sign Alec Martinez, Vegas does, on this three-year, $5 million average per season extension. They know that they're close to the cap. And it seems like, you know, ever since Leonard came in the fold, people were like, is Flurry going to go? So they signed that. And I don't think a lot of people were saying, okay, this is what's going to happen. We're going to lose this guy right here, right now. But basically, I guess that they decided in the best interest of them in their future and being a cup contender, they were going to trade Mark andre Fleury. He has two years left on his deal with $7 million per season cap it. And they trade him to the Chicago Blackhawks. And all they get in return is a AHL player, I believe. And I imagine it had to do with the cap hit. They were just desperate to get that money off the books. And here we are. And this is a quote from Mark andre Fleury's agent, Alan Walsh, uh, saying that basically Mark andre Fleury hasn't even been informed from Vegas. And he says, quote, well, Mark andre Fleury still hasn't heard from anybody with the Vegas Golden Knights. He apparently has been traded to Chicago. Mark andre will be taking his time to discuss the situation with his family and seriously evaluate his future for hockey at this time. Now, there is also some news that he is potentially going to retire, which would be crazy. But there's also news that he, maybe Pittsburgh wants to get in on this and try to get him back. I don't know what's going to happen. Maybe he does retire, but still, it'd be weird to leave two years, $14 million off the books right now. Um, and, you know, that would be weird. I don't know if I see him retiring. I mean, maybe he would play for Chicago, but if you're Pittsburgh, would you try to? I mean, would you dare try to go get Flurry? I think maybe. Uh, for Chicago, Stan Bowman talked about this a little bit, and he said, quote, the opportunity to acquire a Vizna winning goalie is rare and one cannot pass up. Uh, Mark andre Fleury improves our goaltending, strengthens our team defense, and will have a huge impact on the overall development of the Blackhawks. You know, Stan has never been a guy that has not tried to keep good names, or big names, I guess just to say, or, you know, bring in big names. You've got Seth Jones that they just got. You know, they've got Kevin Lankinen, a promising young goaltender, if he can do what he did in the first half of this season. And now you got Mark andre Fleury. I don't know if he's staying. I couldn't tell you there. I don't know what the plan is. We'll find out probably by tonight would be my guess, or within the next few days, what the future of Mark andre Fleury's career is. But yes, he is no longer a Vegas Golden Knight. Let me know what you think of this down in the comments below. Please make sure to like and subscribe. Everybody stay safe. Have a great day and go all fuck you, all right? Goodbye, Brigadiers and Brigadettes. This is your captain signing off. Have a great night.